In this video I'll show you how to create a simple nebulous shockwave effect with the liquify filter. So I'll be adding the effect above and to the right of the model here on a new layer. So I'm just going to grab a big large soft white brush and click it a few times. The next step is I'm going to be erasing parts of this with a large uh, brush that are downloaded um, that's available on the website. Basically the brush looks like um, smoke or an explosion. So I'm going to be taking out the bulk of that uh, white there in the middle and just large portions of the rest of it. As an effect in and of itself it doesn't look too bad but it's not quite what we're aiming for here. So now I'm going to grab the liquify filter and use the forward warp tool. And this is basically just pushing or warping the image there, or just that layer actually. Just controlling the size of the brush, moving it around appropriately. Again, we're only caring about the upper and the right portion of the image at this point. So I'm happy with that, and that's the effect that it ends up with. So I'm just going to grab a normal eraser and get rid of the parts of that layer that I don't want. So just keep on erasing uh, the bits that we don't want here. Might want to warp it some more even. And that's pretty much it. So I actually prefer the version that we did for the website. So I'll just hide that one. Turn on the proper version again. And then just duplicate that and resize and rotate them to put them around the model there. And don't forget if you're a VIP member you do get to download these PSDs for yourself and with a bit of color they look quite good.